From Clee to Heaven, the beacon burns, the shires have seen it plain. From north and south, the sign returns, and beacons burn again. Look left, look right, the hills are bright, the dales are light between. Because tis fifty years tonight that God has saved the Queen. Now when the flame they watch not towers about the soil they trod, lads will remember friends of ours who shared the work with God. The skies that knit their heartstrings right, the fields that bred them brave, the saviors come not home tonight, themselves they could not save. It dawns in Asia, tombstones show, and Shropshire names are red, and the Nile spills his overflow beside the Severn's dead. We pledge in peace by farm and town, the queen they served in war, and fire the beacons up and down, the land they perished for. God save the queen, we living sing, from height to height tis heard, and with the rest your voices ring, lads of the 53rd. Oh, God will save her, fear you not, be you the men you've been, get you the sons your fathers got, and God will save the queen. Loveliest of trees, the cherry now is hung with bloom along the bough and stands about the woodland ride wearing white for Easter tide. Now, of my threescore years and ten, twenty will not come again and take from seventy springs a score. It only leaves me fifty more, and since to look at things in bloom, fifty springs are little room, about the woodlands I will go to see the cherry hung with snow. Leave your home behind, lad, and reach your friends your hand, and go, and luck go with you, while Ludlow Tower shall stand. O come you home of Sunday, when Ludlow streets are still, and Ludlow bells are calling to farm and lane and mill. Or come you home of Monday when Ludlow Market hums and Ludlow chimes are playing, the conquering hero comes. Come you home a hero, or come home not at all. The lads you leave will mind you till Ludlow Tower shall fall, and you will list the bugle that blows in lands of morn and make the foes of England be sorry you were born, and you till trump of doomsday on lands of morn may lie, and make the hearts of comrades be heavy where you die. Leave your home behind you, your friends by field and town, O oh, town and field will mind you, till Ludlow Tower is down.
awake. The silver dusk returning up the breach of darkness brims, and the ship of sunrise burning strands upon the eastern rims. Wake! The vaulted shadow shatters trampled to the floor it spanned, and the tent of night in tatters straws the sky pavilion land. Up, lad, up, tis late for lying, hear the drums of morning play, hark the empty highways crying, who'll be on the hills away? Towns and countries woo together, Forland's beacon, Belfry's call, Never lad that trod on leather lived to feast his heart with all. Up lad, thews that lie in cumber, sunlit pallets never thrive. Morns a bed and daylight slumber were not meant for man alive. Clay lies still, but blood's a rover, breath's a wear that will not keep. Up lad, when the journey's over, There'll be time enough to sleep. Oh, see how thick the gold cup flowers are lying in field and lane with dandelions to tell the hours that never are told again. Oh, may I squire you round the meads and pick you posies gay. Twill do no harm to take my arm. You may, young man, you may. Ah, spring was sent for lass and lad, tis now the blood runs gold, and man and maid had best be glad before the world is old. What flowers today may flower tomorrow, but never as good as new. Suppose I wound my arm right round. Tis true, young man, tis true. Some lads there are, tis shame to say, that only court to thieve. And once they bear the bloom away, tis little enough they leave. Then keep your heart for men like me and safe from trustless chaps. My love is true and all for you. Perhaps, young man, perhaps. Oh, look in my eyes, then, can you doubt? Why, tis a mile from town. How green the grass is all about, we might as well sit down. Ah, life, what is it but a flower? Why must true lovers sigh? Be kind, have pity, my own, my pretty. Goodbye, young man, goodbye. When the lad for longing sighs, mute and dull of cheer and pale, if at death's own door he lies, maiden, you can heal his ale. Lover's ills are all to buy, that wan look, that hollow tone, the hung head, the sunken eye. You can have them for your own. Buy them, buy them, even mourn. Lover's ills are all to sell. Then you can lie down forlorn, but the lover will be well. When smoke stood up from Ludlow, and mist blew off from Tem, and bly the field to plowing against the morning beam, I strode beside my team. The blackbird in the coppice looked out to see me stride, and hearkened as I whistled the tramping team beside, and fluted and replied. 
Lie down, lie down, young yeoman. What use to rise and rise? Rise man a thousand mornings, yet down at last he lies. And then the man is wise. I heard the tune he sang me and spied his yellow bill. I picked the stone and aimed it and threw it with a will. Then the bird was still. Then my soul beside me took up the blackbird strain and still beside the horses along the dewy lane it sang the song again. Lie down, lie down, young yeoman. The sun moves always west. The road one treads to labor will lead one down to rest. And that will be the best. Farewell to barn and stack and tree. Farewell to Severn Shore. Terence, look your last at me, for I come home no more. The sun burns on the half-mown hill. By now, the blood is dried. And Maurice amongst the hay lies still. My knife is at his side. My mother thinks us long away. Tis time the fields are mown. She had two sons at rising day. Tonight she'll be alone. And here's a bloody hand to shake, and oh man, here's goodbye. We'll sweat no more on scythe and rake, my bloody hands and I. I wish you strength to bring you pride and a love to keep you clean. And I wish you luck come Lammastide at racing on the green. Long for me the rick will wait, and long will wait the fold, and long will stand the empty plate, and dinner will be cold. On moonlit heath and lonesome bank, the sheep beside me graze, and yon the gallows used to clank, fast by the four cross ways. A careless shepherd once would keep the flocks by moonlight there, and high amongst the glimmering sheep, the dead man stood on air. They hang us now in Shrewsbury jail. The whistles blow forlorn, and trains all night groan on the rail to men that die at morn. There sleeps in Shrewsbury jail tonight, or wakes as may betide. A better lad if things went right than most that sleep outside. And naked to the hangman's noose, the morning clocks will ring, a neck God made for other use than strangling in a string. And sharp the link of life will snap, and dead on air will stand, heels that held up as straight a chap as treads upon the land. So here I'll watch the night and wait to see the morning shine when he will hear the stroke of eight, and not the stroke of nine. And wish my friend as sound asleep as lads I did not know, that shepherded the moonlit sheep a hundred 
years ago. The sun at noon to higher air, unharnessing the silver pair that late before his chariot swam, rides on the gold wool of the ram. So braver notes the stormcock sings to start the rusted wheel of things, and brutes in field and brutes in pen leap that the world goes round again. The boys are up the woods with day to fetch the daffodils away. At home, at noonday, from the hills they bring no dearth of daffodils. A field for palms the girls repair, and sure enough the palms are there, and each will find, by hedge or pond, her waving silver tufted wand. In farm and field through all the shire the eye beholds the heart's desire. Ah, let not only mine be vain, for lovers should be loved again. On your midnight pallet lying, listen and undo the door. Lads that waste the light in sighing in the dark should sigh no more. Night should ease a lover's sorrow, therefore since I go tomorrow, pity me before. In the land to which I travel, the far dwelling let me say, once, if here the couch is gravel, in a kinder bed I lay, and the breast the darnel smothers rested once upon another's, when it was not clay. When I watch the living meet, and the moving pageant file, warm and breathing through the street, where I lodge a little while. If the heats of hate and lust in the house of flesh are strong, let me mind the house of dust, where my sojourn shall be long. In the nation that is not, nothing stands that stood before. There, revenges are forgot, and the hater hates no more. Lovers lying two and two, ask not whom they sleep beside, and the bridegroom all night through never turns him to the bride. When I was one and twenty, I heard a wise man say, Give crowns and pounds and guineas, but not your heart away. Give pearls away and rubies, but keep your fancy free. 
but I was one in twenty. No use to talk to me. When I was one in twenty, I heard him say again, the heart out of the bosom was never given in vain. Tis paid with sighs of plenty and sold for endless rue. And I am two and twenty, and oh, tis true, tis true. There pass the careless people that call their souls their own. Here by the road I loiter, how idle and alone. Ah, past the plunge of plummet in seas I cannot sound. My heart and soul and senses, world without end are drowned. His folly has not fellow beneath the blue of day that gives to man or woman his heart and soul away. Their flowers no balm to sain him from east of earth to west that's lost for everlasting the heart out of his breast. Here by the laboring highway, with empty hands I stroll, see deep till doomsday morning, lie lost my heart and soul. Look not in my eyes, for fear they mirror true the sight I see, and there you find your face too clear, and love it, and be lost like me. One the long night through must lie, spent in star-defeated sighs, but why should you, as well as I, perish? Gaze not in my eyes. A Grecian lad, as I hear tell, one that many loved in vain, looked into a forest well and never looked away again. There, when the turf and springtime flowers with downward eye and gazes sad, stands amid the glancing showers, a jonquil, not a Grecian lad. It nods and curtsies and recovers when the winds blow above the nettle on the graves of lovers that hang themselves for love. The nettle nods, the wind blows over, the man, he does not move. The lover of the grave, the lover that hanged himself for love. 